I, I came uh, on a second visit to Ukraine um, simply to say that uh, with the passage of time, uh, all of uh, the Knights of Columbus remember what is happening in Ukraine, uh, stand with um, not only their fellow Knights, but all of Ukraine uh, in this ongoing struggle. And uh, on this visit, um, I got closer to the reality of the war. Uh, in going to Bucha and seeing places where uh, there were mass murders, mass graves, and meeting children who had been orphaned, wives who had lost husbands, mothers who had lost sons. Uh, the war became uh, very, very real to me and to my heart. And it is a message I will take with me uh, that we must never forget, that we must stand together, that we must pray for peace uh, in Ukraine. So this m visit uh, was very, very moving to me. And uh, I also came away amazed at the resilience and the courage of the Ukrainian people. The Knights of Columbus mission is even more important during time of war. Um, for one thing, the humanitarian needs uh, multiply when a war is going on. And the Knights have stepped up uh, to provide that, uh, beginning with the care packages, beginning here at this patriarchal cathedral where we are standing, um, but also meeting other needs, meeting the needs of widows and orphans. Uh, yesterday, I gave warm coats uh, to some beautiful, deserving children, many of whom uh, have lost uh, their fathers in, in the course of, of the war, uh, meeting the psychological needs that the war has uh, brought about in the minds and hearts of many, uh, helping uh, military families. Um, so many things the Knights are doing right now uh, to support those affected by the war. Thank you.